welcome back to my channel. So it has been a crazy week, so I wasn't able to finish the last vlog I did. I will insert the clips, but I actually rescued a duck. And the duck did not live, unfortunately, so I didn't really wanna to upload too much of that just because it makes me sad. But we have a fun day today. It's Katie's birthday, and I am fixing to make a Weight Watchers cake for her birthday, and then also I'm gonna cook dinner tonight. So I was going to show you what I was going to make. Okay, so the cake is called Lightened Up Cream Cheese Chocolate Cake off the pounddropper.com. Um, basically, you can look up the recipe. I'll put the link below, but it calls for the sugar-free devil's food, which I did not have. I'm not in focus. Hello. There we go. Which I did not have. So I'm going to replace it with yellow classic mix. So hopefully this will taste just as good. So I went ahead and put it in my KitchenAid bowl and then I'm going to add three eggs and I think like applesauce and stuff, but I'll show you that in just a second. So it called for half a cup of unsweetened applesauce and then one cup of water. So I mixed all that in there with the three eggs and the cakes mix. cake mix. So I'm going to blend it until it is blended well. So we'll see how it turns out. So this is the top layer. It calls for three eggs. It calls for four ounces of the low-fat cream cheese. It calls for two cups of low-fat or no-fat ricotta cheese. Um, then I say three more eggs. <laughs> and then also you need one tablespoon of vanilla and then also half a cup of whatever sweetener, so like Splenda, whatever sweetener you wanna use, and then mix that pretty well together. So now that it's finished, you want to pour on top of the cake batter. It will sink in once you bake it. So we're gonna pour it and then you bake it for 50 to 60 minutes and then the Cool Whip topping goes on last. Do you know what it's for? <laughs> I knew she didn't even know. So it's a massage. You're welcome. Oh, hurts so good. Yeah, and she's not painful. Like she's actually feels really good. Yeah, that is the gift. But then I got you like these. This is coffee, and I haven't tried it. I bought one for myself, and I got it at the um, Savannah Bee Company at Saint Thomas Island. Um, and then I think it's like a little info card in there. There's, I think it's all that is, but. Um, so I just got the cake out of the oven and it smells fabulous. I cooked it on 350 for 50 minutes. Now I'm going to whip up the whipped topping and um, I'll let you know what that is. But you need to let it cool because it's really hot and then we'll chill it after we put the whipped topping on. And it says chill for about six to eight hours or um, you can put it overnight. Just kind of whatever you prefer. Just have it, it's supposed to be a cooled cake. So now we are making the whipped topping. She's adding two cups of skim milk. We did two packages of sugar-free chocolate pudding. And then we added one thing of whipped fat-free topping. Um, yeah, it's fat-free Kroger brand right there. And then we're gonna whip it up and hopefully we can place it on top. I don't know if I'm gonna have enough room, but everyone say happy birthday. <laughs> So this is for dinner and I made jalapeno poppers. So for two jalapenos, it's only three points. On the inside, it's cream cheese. I know you hear the crying baby, that's my niece. She's not happy right now. But um, also turkey sausage, um, reduced fat Mexican style blend cheese, and then a little on top. Um, like I said, there are three points per serving, which are two, and I will link the recipe that I created um, in the description box below. So definitely try them. I'm super excited to have them. And you bake them for 15 minutes on 400. Also made some baked chicken. It's just oregano and seasoned salt and stuff like that. And you bake it. I baked it for about 40 minutes 
on 350 and then I made some summer squash so I'm excited for this this whole meal is only going to be three points with the two jalapeno poppers but I haven't eaten today so I'll probably eat two servings and have a total of six points for dinner Thank you. happy birthday dear Katie happy birthday to you So this is the dessert and it turned out phenomenal. So this is just a mousse on top. That is the cake right there and that's a cheesecake layer. Y'all, best dessert ever. It is so good. So Katie and I, we're gonna enjoy it. So 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. <laughs> so we're gonna watch The Bachelorette and enjoy the rest of her birthday. So what do we say, Katie? <laughs> Don't forget to like and subscribe. And hit that bell button. Hit that bell button. Boop. Peace.